Okay. So if a candidate who is, a, I should say, if a researcher mm. who is undergoing the course of PhD and wishes to join corporate, mm. first of all, you know, uh, that is a very, uh, that is uh, taken to be a very unusual choice, which is absolutely not because, you know, I like your question very much because generally people think that you're doing a PhD. So you'll eventually go into academics, which is mm. absolutely not. Right. So while the course of PhD, if or when a researcher is undergoing the process, so do not forget to connect with the people. Yeah. Yes. Do not forget to connect with the people. Your networking is very important. Because see, when you are a researcher during the course of data collection, right, during attending and delivering the sessions, maybe in the same institute or another places, or attending some conferences or seminars. So you meet people from corporate industry as well, right? And even if you are meeting with the academic people, they are further connected, mm. right? It's very important to connect with the people. And that's what I'm telling from my personal experience. Mm -hmm. Connection, networking is very important. Networking is very important. Second thing is work on your CV. See, we generally, being a researcher, uh, never put so much of trust that the kind of CV we develop, it is more of academic oriented, mm -hmm. right? Mm -hmm. So redesigning your CV as per showcasing and fulfilling it to the corporate needs is very important. Mm -hmm. Your CV, being a researcher, should mm -hmm. reflect that, yes, you have an inclination and you have all the skills and competency which is required by a uh, corporate mm -hmm. networking and your CV. Mm -hmm. Then comes your skills. See, mm -hmm. don't forget. See, skills are very see. You are already in a research. You are working in a dedicated topic, and you put your blood, heart, and soul in researching a particular topic. My suggestion would be that gone are the times that you are just living with one topic for a good four to five years and then you come up to and then I want a job. No, you know, mm -hmm. those, those times are gone. You need to get in touch that I'm not saying that if you are pursuing your PhD in marketing, so just go for some accounting skill course, certificate course. I'm not saying that. What I'm saying is if, I'm, if you are pursuing your PhD in marketing, Get in touch with what is happening on the digital world of marketing because mm -hmm. this is something which is rock of the town these days. Mm -hmm. If you're pursuing your market, uh, PhD in HR, then just not focus on uh, you know training and development, which is your topic. Talk also about artificial intelligence, which is the talk of the town in HR. Mm -hmm. So always be in touch on the rate, latest development latest uh, introductions in terms of your skills of your domain mm -hmm. so by the end of your phd you are not just the master of your own topic mm -hmm. you are actually aware of what all happening in your domain okay. so remain connected work on your cv please develop your skills taking additional knowledge is never an harm mm -hmm. Is never a harm, right? So, and what a corporate see is that how much you will be beneficial for them. See, eventually everybody talks about ROI, right? So, if they are investing in you, they want, they do not want a teacher. They mm. want somebody who can be, uh, you know, who can prove to be an asset for their organization. So, develop yourself as a holistic package that if not this, I have this. Mm. If not this, I have this. Another thing is work on your LinkedIn profile, okay. which is often neglected. Not nowadays. People have started coming, you know, coming a lot on LinkedIn profile. But, you know, being a researcher, we are so much involved in our work that we at time ignore things are happening. And by the time we are done with our work, by the time we are, we are, we are done with the PhD, we see, oh, the world has already moved five years ahead. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. So, please mark your presence on LinkedIn. Not only mark your presence, update your presence. Mm -hmm. Which will also allow you to negotiate in future. Mm -hmm. So, your networking, your skills, your 
social media presence it will give you all together a common package so that you can you know have a better negotiation you can have a better package of negotiation skills by the end of phd which will pave the way for you to go into industry